You have heard of Saudi Arabia becoming rich due to oil selling, right? But now Saudi wants to be rich in intelligence, not just human intelligence, artificial intelligence. And this week something huge happened in Riyadh that's shaking up the global AI game. On May 13th, in the heart of Riyadh during the Saudi US investment forum, Nvidia CEO Jensen Huang made a massive announcement. Nvidia is selling over 18,000 of its most powerful AI chips to a Saudi company called Humain or Humain, whatever way you want to pronounce. These chips are called Blackwell GB300. These are some of the latest and strongest GPUs in the world, and they are not going into laptops or phones. They are going into giant AI data centers with enough power to light up an entire city, 500 megawatts of capacity. So, what is this mysterious company called Humain? It's a new AI company fully backed by Saudi Arabia's public investment fund. You know, the same fund that owns shares in football clubs, tech giants and now investing in AI. Jensen Huang has put it beautifully. He said, Saudi Arabia is transforming its energy into intelligence. They are calling these data centers AI factories, powered by Nvidia and soon also by AMD, who announced the chips will be part of the project too. It is wise not to be dependent on one supplier. Now, this is not a small side project. Humane has committed $10 billion to building this massive AI setup. Think about that. Saudi is not just buying chips. They are building a whole AI industry from scratch. It's like laying the foundation for a new kind of oil, digital oil. And they are not doing it alone. The same day, Amazon Web Services came in with their own massive news. AWS and Humane announced a $5 billion partnership to build something called AI Zone in Saudi Arabia. This AI zone is going to be one of a kind, combining AWS's strongest AI services like SageMaker, Bedrock and Amazon Q with Saudi's big vision. As you know, cloud services are now getting fully integrated with AI. The combined ecosystem will unlock immense potential across industries. So what is the goal? The goal is to make Saudi Arabia not just a user of AI, but a global leader in it. This whole AI push fits perfectly with Saudi's Vision 2030, a national plan to move beyond oil, build a knowledge economy and lead the world in futuristic tech. With AWS already building an infrastructure region that will launch in 2026, this new AI zone is an extra cherry on top. Saudi Arabia's Minister of IT, Abdullah al Swaha summed it up by saying this lays the foundation for the intelligent era and reinforces Saudi as a global AI partner. But this isn't just about tech headlines. Thanks to this project, Saudi Arabia will soon see AI changing education, healthcare, governance and energy. Imagine students using AI-powered tutors in Arabic, doctors catching diseases early through AI scans, government services becoming super fast and efficient, and yes, even oil production getting smarter, like predictive maintenance, safety, optimization, etc. etc. All powered by NVIDIA chips, AWS servers, and a Saudi-led vision. But what's technology without people? AWS is not just dropping infrastructure. They are also training 100,000 Saudis in AI and cloud skills. They even launched a program to upskill 10,000 Saudi women for free in cloud tech. Through the Amazon Academy, young Saudis, whether in college or switching careers, can learn AI, cloud computing and leadership for free. And let's not forget startups. Saudi startups raised $750 million in 2024 and now with Humane and AWS in the game, local entrepreneurs will get access to the same tools used by global tech giants. AWS will bring programs like AWS Activate to support them from day one. This is how Saudi plans to supercharge its tech scene from garage startups to AI unicorns. Now according to PwC, AI will contribute $130 billion to Saudi's economy by 2030. That is more than 40% of the total AI impact in the entire Middle East. When more and more companies move to cloud, AI adoption will only accelerate. With global giants like Nvidia, AMD and Amazon on board, Saudi Arabia is not just joining the AI race, they are aiming to lead it. So from oil rigs to AI rigs, from deserts to data centers, Saudi Arabia is building something bold, a new future powered by chips, cloud and big dreams. Can Saudi really become a global AI hub? Let's see how things will turn out. Hope you found this video informative. I'll see you in the next one.